How's it going everybody? Dotodoy here and I am very excited today because we have a huge video topic. You didn't read the title wrong, you didn't see the thumbnail wrong. Dragon Ball Fighters has announced its next DLC character and it will be Ultra Instinct Goku. Now we aren't exactly 100% sure what form he's going to take, whether it will be Ultra Instinct Omen or the perfected Ultra Instinct because all we have to go on right now is a text leak from the upcoming V-Jump that just mentions him being in his Ultra Instinct state. Other than that, we were also told to stick around for more information as more details will be announced at the Dragon Ball Fighters World Tour Finals event from 2019 to 2020, which will run from February 8th to February 9th in Paris, France. If you guys aren't aware of what that event is, it's basically the World Finals for Dragon Ball Fighters Season 2. The simple way to put it is it's basically Dragon Ball Fighters' biggest tournament. So what exactly does this DLC character mean for the game? Well, obviously, we can expect a Season 3 of DLC to surely follow behind him. You can definitely expect to see that happen. Overall, this is just very similar to what happened last year when Season 1 ended. They gave us some information in the V-Jump before the month of the tournament that basically just confirmed Jiren for us, but didn't show anything else. So if you remember how that went down, we knew Jiren was coming, but we didn't know Videl was coming. And we certainly didn't think they would also announce Gogeta Blue and Broly. So as far as what other things could get announced at this event, I really have no idea, and I don't even want to guess because I don't want to set people's expectations too low or too high. I wouldn't go into this expecting a repeat of how much information we got at last year's tournament, considering we got four character reveals two of them being new characters that at the time were pretty much fresh on everybody's mind. But combine this character with some other dramatic finish leaks that you guys might have seen. I didn't get a chance to cover it on the channel because uh, I don't think Bandai was very happy that that data mine got out there. But I think a lot of this points to the fact that we can expect maybe a tournament of power stage. I know I might be getting my hopes up because, you know, with the dramatic finish with Gogeta Blue and Broly, that would have been a great time to put in another glacial stage. We didn't exactly get that. But I don't know. I really think they're going to put in a T.O.P. stage for some reason. Another character that comes to my mind when I think Ultra Instinct Goku and the Tournament of Power is of course Kefla. Now that we know that a season three and more characters are on the table, her being in the game is almost no question to me. She just seems like a surefire choice. She's super popular and she would do a great job at filling out the roster. But other than that guys, I really don't have too much to talk about because we don't actually have the visuals for the scans in front of us. I just thought this was such big news that I should put it out there regardless. This is super exciting news. I personally have been waiting for Ultra Instinct Goku for a while now. He's such a cool form to me and I know a lot of people disagree. It's another Goku. And I'm definitely down to hear your thoughts in the comment section below. But hey, also let me know what other characters you're excited to potentially see. Just because we're getting Ultra Instinct Goku doesn't mean that's going to be the last character, or at least I hope. <laughs> but yeah, guys, while you're down in the comment section, make sure to like the video and subscribe if you enjoy this kind of stuff and want to stay up to date on all the Dragon Ball Fighters information that we will be getting very shortly. I have been Dr. Doya. Thank you so much for sticking with me over the course of Season 2, and I guess I'll see you in Season 3.